Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the Duke Blue Devils. The South Regional Champions, let's meet them now. First off, from Melbourne, Arkansas, please welcome senior guard Jordan Davidson. This freshman hit a couple of monster three-pointers in the South Regional Final. He's from Chesapeake, Virginia, Andre Dawkins. A junior from Colorado Springs, Colorado 6'5", junior Steve Johnson. A freshman from Raleigh, North Carolina, 6'10", center forward Ryan Kelly. And from Red Bank, New Jersey, a warm salute. Welcome to junior guard Casey Peters. Now there's only one set of brothers at the final four this weekend, and they happen to be from Indiana, about 130 miles away in Warsaw. I was talking to them a couple weeks ago in Jacksonville. They so desperately wanted to come back to Indiana and bring their teammates with them. Again, we're going alphabetically. So let's meet the youngest first freshman, Mason Plumley. And then there's a sophomore brother who gave him five points, five boards uh, this season off the bench. Please welcome Miles Plumley. The leading scorer, a senior from Northbrook, Illinois, and boy was he simmering on Sunday, hitting shots. John Shire. Sharp shooting junior forward, gives him over 17 a game from Medford, Oregon. Here is Kyle Singler. Starting guard who comes off a career high 29 points in the regional final game against Baylor. Here is Nolan Smith. <laughs> Senior co captain starter from Scotch Plains, New Jersey, Lance Thomas. <laughs> from Lake Forest, Illinois, 6'8, freshman Todd Zafarovsky. And the final introduction goes to a guy who hears the zoo from the Duke crowd, averaging over 10 rebounds a game since he went into the starting lineup about 14 games back. Here's Brian Zubek. <laughs> and let's meet the coaching staff here for Coach K, all former players for him at Duke. Nate James. <laughs> Steve Wojciechowski. And Chris Collins. And the head coach of the Duke Blue Devils, Coach Mike Krzyzewski. I say we talk to the two senior co-captains. Lance, you come on up here. John, you come on up here, too. Guys, welcome. All right, here. We had a little chat after the game the other day. You just kept keeping the ball alive there. That game was really a, a thriller down in Houston. Tell me about how much it meant for you in your last year to take this team to the Final Four? It means the world to me. Um, the game was by no means easy. Uh, we had to fight, especially in the end. And um, I'm just happy that my teammates, after four years, especially my classmates, uh, and John and Zubek, uh, four years to get here and we're here. What was it like back on campus in Durham when you returned from Houston? Oh, it was good. Uh, our camera crazies were out there waiting for us when we got back. And you know we shared that moment with them. And, this had, this had had to be here. Very sweet. Who who is the uh, if you will the, the team prankster on 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 Duke? Oh, it's definitely John and Brian Zubek. Oh, right? Yeah, two wild and crazy guys, huh? Uh, definitely. The zoo, zoo's a he's a wild man, huh? Yeah, they, their pranks are pretty good. <laughs> Any you can tell us about? Oh uh, yeah. Uh, well, there's times where uh, one of them won't be in the locker room and uh, they'll open their locker door and put uh, water there with the top off of it. So when the person opens it, the water falls all over. That's a good one. <laughs> Works every time. <laughs> You've been known to do that, huh, John? Just from time to time. <laughs> <laughs> How about for you, uh, you know, all your years like Lance and building up to a senior year to remember? Yeah, it's been a special year for us. We've uh, worked real hard all four years and we're happy to be in this position. What's it going to be like, you think, when you walk out there on that stage? I mean, the stadium, it's magnificent the way it's set up. You know, we had this kind of uh, atmosphere last year in Detroit at Ford Field, and they tell me that it is just beautiful. I know you practiced over there. What's it look like to you? Yeah, it's uh, a little bit similar to what it was in Houston playing the Dome, but it's 
Um, it's great playing there and has a great feel to us, so we're really looking forward to get out of there. Well, good luck, John. And Lance and the whole Duke Blue Double team will look forward to seeing you this week in Indianapolis. And uh, let's go back out to the crowd right now. Greg Anthony, take it away.